Hey everybody out there, it's Pastor John with your midweek reflection. Uh, this week we continue our series WDJD, What Did Jesus Do? Um, and, and we've seen how Jesus in his baptism identified with humanity, how Jesus blazed a new path for humanity uh, in his temptation by resisting the devil's uh, temptations. Uh, we've seen that Jesus uh, last week uh, formed a community of kingdom learners, so Jesus was a teacher. Uh, this week we get into the next aspect of Jesus' ministry, as Matthew tells the story, and that's Jesus' healing. Uh, we're going to be looking really at Matthew 8 through 11, um, in little bits and pieces of it at least. And uh, one of the questions uh, that I encourage you to ponder is a personal question. Um, as we prepare for Sunday, what do you feel like Jesus needs to do for you? What do you feel like Jesus needs to do for you? Um, it's a question about your, your felt need for faith, for Jesus, for God. Um, and so, you know, ponder that over the next uh, uh, few days. And, and I'd really encourage you to, um, you're probably seeing this video because it's been posted on our church's Facebook page. Um, you know, respond to, to, to some of these questions in the comments section, and, and the conversation can already be going as we approach Sunday. And sometimes that even gives me help in preparing for a sermon, is to kind of see where you're coming from on some of these questions. Uh, the next question that you might think about is, is next couple questions are really theological questions. Um, the Bible is clear that, that a central problem for humanity is what we call sin. Um, and so what would you, how would you define sin? What is sin? How does it affect us? Why is it a problem for us? What, what is sin uh, as you understand it from the scriptures? And, and, and then along with that, um, the gospel necessarily means that Jesus has done something about sin. So what, according to the gospel, uh, how would you answer the question, what did Jesus do about our sin? Um, these are some questions we're going to be looking at on Sunday, and, and I think um, <clears throat> maybe talking about the gospel in, in some new ways, uh, get some different perspectives than what we might typically hear. Um, and so, you know, be, but be thinking about that uh, so you know where you're starting from. And maybe, again, comment so I know where you're starting from as we, as we look at these issues, uh, these questions on Sunday as we worship. Uh, as always, I look forward to worshiping with you as we live the gospel life together. And until then, may God bless you.